Listen to the conversation between Sophia and Emma about sharing travel plans. Listen, and then some questions will be asked about the conversation. You will also learn some useful vocabularies and expressions afterwards. Listen carefully. Hey Emma, guess what? I have some exciting news to share. Hi Sophia. What's up? Tell me, tell me. Well, my family and I are planning a trip to the beach next month. Wow, that sounds amazing. Which beach are you going to? We're going to visit Myrtle Beach in South Carolina. I heard it's really beautiful there. That's awesome. How long will you be staying? We'll be staying for a whole week. I can't wait to relax by the ocean and build sandcastles. Me too. Are you going to do any fun activities while you're there? Definitely. We're planning to go paddleboarding, play beach volleyball, and maybe even go parasailing if we're feeling adventurous. That sounds like so much fun. I wish I could come with you. I wish you could too, Emma. Maybe we can plan a trip together sometime in the future. That would be awesome. So, have you started packing yet? Not yet, but my mom made a list of things we need to bring. We have to pack sunscreen, swimsuits, beach towels, and snacks for the road trip. Don't forget to bring a hat and sunglasses to protect yourself from the sun. Oh yeah, thanks for reminding me. I'll make sure to pack those too. No problem. Is your family driving to the beach? Yeah, we're going to drive there. It's about a six-hour drive from where we live, so we'll probably stop for lunch along the way. That sounds like a long drive, but it'll be worth it once you get to the beach. I know, I'm so excited. It's going to be the highlight of my summer. Mine too. Hey, do you think you could send me some pictures while you're at the beach? Of course. I'll make sure to take lots of photos and send them to you. Thanks, Sophia. I can't wait to see them. No problem, Emma. I'll make sure to capture all the fun moments so you feel like you're right there with us. That would be awesome. Hey, have you ever been to Myrtle Beach before? No, this will be my first time going there. I've heard it's really beautiful though, so I'm excited to see it for myself. Same here. I've never been to Myrtle Beach either but I've seen pictures and it looks amazing. Yeah, I can't wait to see the crystal clear water and feel the warm sand between my toes. Me too. Hey, do you know if there are any good seafood restaurants near the beach? I'm not sure, but I heard there are a lot of great seafood places in Myrtle Beach. We'll have to ask the locals for recommendations when we get there. Sounds like a plan. I love seafood so I can't wait to try some fresh fish and shrimp. Same here. Hey, do you think we'll have time to go souvenir shopping while we're at the beach? I hope so. I love buying souvenirs to remember my trips by. Me too. I want to get a seashell necklace and maybe a t-shirt with Myrtle Beach written on it. That sounds like a great idea. I might get a keychain or a magnet for my fridge. Yeah, those are always fun souvenirs to have. Hey, have you ever gone surfing before? No, I haven't. Have you? No, but I've always wanted to try it. Maybe we can take a surfing lesson while we're at the beach. That would be so cool. I've heard surfing is really fun but also challenging. Yeah, it looks like it takes a lot of balance and coordination but I think it would be a fun experience to try at least once. Definitely. Hey, do you know if there are any bike rental places near the beach? I'm not sure, but I think I saw some bike rental shops when I was looking up things to do in Myrtle Beach. We can rent bikes and ride along the boardwalk. That sounds like so much fun. I love riding bikes, especially by the ocean. Yeah, it's so relaxing and peaceful. Plus, we'll get some exercise while we're at it. 
Exactly. Hey, what are you most looking forward to about the trip? Hmm, that's a tough question. I think I'm most looking forward to spending quality time with my family and making memories that will last a lifetime. Ah, that's sweet. I feel the same way. Trips are always more fun when you're with the people you love. Definitely. Hey, do you have any tips for staying safe at the beach? Yeah, make sure to always swim near a lifeguard, apply sunscreen regularly, and stay hydrated by drinking lots of water. Good advice. I'll make sure to keep that in mind while we're at the beach. Also, be careful of jellyfish and stingrays in the water. If you get stung, tell a lifeguard right away. Thanks for the heads up. I'll be sure to watch out for them. No problem. Hey, have you started counting down the days until the trip? Yes, I have. Only three more weeks to go until we leave. That's so exciting. The time will fly by before you know it. I hope so. I can't wait to finally feel the sand between my toes and hear the sound of the waves crashing against the shore. Me too. Hey, do you think we could have a beach party when you get back from your trip? That's a great idea. We can have a barbecue, play beach games, and maybe even make some homemade ice cream. That sounds like so much fun. I can't wait to hear all about your trip when you get back. I can't wait to tell you all about it. It's going to be the best vacation ever. I'm sure it will be. Well, I better let you go so you can start packing for your trip. Yeah, I should probably get started on that. Thanks for chatting with me, Emma. No problem, Sophia. Have a great time at the beach. I'll talk to you later. Thanks, Emma. Bye. Bye. Now answer these questions. Where is Sophia planning to go for her trip? How long will Sophia and her family be staying at the beach? What activities does Sophia plan to do at the beach? Why does Emma wish she could come with Sophia on her trip? What items does Sophia need to pack for her trip? How far is the drive to Myrtle Beach from where Sophia lives? What does Emma suggest Sophia bring to protect herself from the sun? How does Sophia plan to get around at the beach? What is Sophia most looking forward to about the trip? What safety tips does Emma give Sophia for the beach? However, if you were unable to answer any of the questions, the answers are mentioned in the description as well. Vocabularies and Expressions Parasailing It is a recreational activity where a person is towed behind a boat while attached to a parachute-like canopy, known as a parasail, which lifts them into the air. For example, Sophia mentioned that she might go parasailing during her trip to the beach if she's feeling adventurous. Boardwalk. It is a wooden pathway or promenade along a beach, typically built to provide easy access for pedestrians. For example, Sophia plans to rent bikes and ride along the boardwalk during her stay at Myrtle Beach. Souvenir. It is a keepsake or memento obtained as a reminder of a place visited, an event attended, or an experience. For example, Sophia wants to buy a seashell necklace and a t-shirt with Myrtle Beach written on it as souvenirs from her trip. Paddleboarding. It means a water sport in which a person stands on a paddleboard and uses a paddle to propel themselves through the water. For example, Sophia is excited to try paddleboarding while she's at the beach. Crystal clear. It means extremely clear and transparent often used to describe water. For example, 
Sophia mentioned that she can't wait to see the crystal clear water at Myrtle Beach. Coordination. It means the ability to use different parts of the body together smoothly and efficiently. For example, Sophia thinks that surfing requires a lot of balance and coordination. Highlight. It means the most memorable or exciting part of an event or experience. For example, Sophia said that going to the beach will be the highlight of her summer. Barbecue. It is a meal or gathering at which meat, fish, or other food is cooked outdoors on a rack or over an open fire. For example, Emma suggested having a barbecue beach party when Sophia returns from her trip. Adventurous. It means eager to take risks or engage in exciting activities. For example, Sophia mentioned possibly going parasailing if she's feeling adventurous during her beach trip. Lifeguard. A lifeguard is a trained individual responsible for ensuring the safety of swimmers at beaches, pools, or other aquatic facilities. For example, a lifeguard might rescue a swimmer in distress and administer first aid if needed. Thanks for listening. Don't forget to like and subscribe if you found this video helpful.